Welcome to AccuWeb Hosting Video Tutorial. Today we will guide you on how to enable TLS 1.2 on Windows 10. Before we begin the tutorial have a quick look at our contact details for your hosting requirements. You can visit our website at www.accuwebhosting.com. You can raise a chat from the chat option available on our website. You can also contact us on this number. You can send us an email at sales at accuwebhosting.com. Thanks you. Let's begin the tutorial. Click on the search option located on the status bar. Type run in the search field. Once you type run in the search field, you will see run option. Click on it. It will open a run dialog box. In the run field type reg edit. And click on the OK button to open the registry editor. Once you click on the OK button, you will get registry editor window. Click on the HKEY local machine. After then click on the system. After then click on the current control set. After then click on the control. Scroll down the screen. Select the folder security provider and click on it. After then click on the S channel. After then click on the protocols. Here you can see the protocol which are enabled on your local system. To enable TLS 1.2, right click on the protocols folder and select new option. After then click on the key option. Once you click on the key option, one new folder will be created with the name new key 1. You have to rename it with the name TLS 1.2. Type TLS 1.2. And press enter. Right click on the TLS 1.2 key and select new option. After then click on the key option. By clicking on the key option, one new folder will be created with the name new key 1. You have to rename it with the name client. Type client. And press enter. Again right click on the client key and select new option. After then click on the DWORD 32 bit value option from the drop down list. Once you click on the DWORD 32 bit value, it will create a file with the name new value 1. You have to rename it with the name disabled by default. Type disabled by default and press enter. Right click on the name disabled by default and select modify from the drop down menu. Ensure that the value data field is set to 0 and the base is hexadecimal. Click on OK to save it. Again right click on the client key and select the new option. After then click on the DWORD 32 bit value option from the drop down list. It will create a file with the name new value 1. You have to rename it with the name enabled. Type enabled. And press enter. Right click on the name enabled and select modify from the drop down menu. Ensure that the value data field is set to 1 and the base is hexadecimal. Click on OK to save it. Once you're done, close registry editor and make sure to reboot the machine to make changes effective. After reboot, your system will be able to communicate through the TLS protocol you enabled. Let's quickly sum up the context of this video. We seen how to enable TLS 1.2 on Windows 10. Hope. This video will be helpful for you. If you like this video please click on the thumb buttons. Also, click on the subscribe button to get more updates regarding the videos. Thank you for watching.